stone is rhyolite. This that stone comes from east of Fallon in the, in the in the hills, east of Fallon. That's a natural natural color of the stone. The Sioux tribe call it Chanupa, and that's what we call it. Chanupa, and I'm a pipe maker. And the pipe is used for prayers. They call it peace pipe, and it's not a peace pipe. The pipe is used in sweat lodges for prayers, or. When people go out on a vision quest, they take a pipe with them. Pipe stone, mm -hmm. and he comes from Minnesota. He goes clear to the quarry to, to get it. Usually people go in there and pray for someone that's sick. I've heard people go in and ask the creator for a job or things like that, but the belief is that the, the smoke that rises from the pipe and your prayers are in that smoke that rises to the Creator. How many thousands of years, I don't know, but it's, it's been, pipes have been, been used a long time, and medicine men carry those pipes. They can't be stealing, they can't be doing, doing things that's, that's, that's against the law. Pipe carrier has to live, live by the pipe, and that's the way the pipe is used. He, my friend, he, he cuts them and polishes them. That's far as he goes. He doesn't doesn't make anything out of them. He just that's his delight. He lo he just loves to do that. And this here's a bullseye. It takes him a month to to get them like this. My older brother that lives next door, he was always making things. He was making he'll make spears or arrows or I think he made pipes too. So when I see, I saw him do it, I said, why can't I do it? So I think I'll try making pipe. Yeah, this, this sinew here, this, be made into strings like that, if you have to get to soak it. And that's what holds your arrows under your shaft. See, there's a, there's a sinew. See, you see how it's that's tied on there? And it also is used here, on this feather, on the end of this feather here, and on this end here, all sinew. I did get to finally start working with Mr. Toby, and now we're deep into our second pipe we're working on. If someone would have told me 10 years ago that I'd be working, uh, making ceremonial pipes, I would have laughed at them. But uh, now it's becoming a reality, and uh, I'm just really happy. We use these drills, hand drills. We don't make them anymore. And this is a small one. And I'll show you a still smaller one. <laughs> now, there was a man living here at the time. He was a Sioux and he was a sun dancer. And he was the one that introduced all of this. The sweat lodge and the, and the uh, sun dance. His name was Max Bear. I believe he was the one that introduced all this and got our Paiute started on this. This, this is deer horn. That, this is what I take it out of, this, this deep piece of deer horn, see how white it is there? It's not very often you find a piece of deer horn that's all white in there like this in here. That's why I've been using that. And that has to be perfectly round so there's no air leak. It, we put a little bit of oil on there and that oil is biodegradable and it's non-toxic that oil is that virgin um, olive oil and it shines it up really nice and I always thought that they used like a lacquer or shellac but Hillman said no we use something that's very uh, non-toxic and I love that uh, idea Yeah, this stone comes from Nixon, the quarry. And I, it's a uh, limestone, I believe they call it, limestone. And they used it during World War II. It, 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 it was pretty hard. It, it's this kind of hard rock. I had to be very careful when they made that one. And, and these, these lines here, they look like copper. But they came off of a tree that I found up, up in, in the 
uh, pea vine. They're all piped on except this one here. And except, I don't know what, that's a green stone. That I, like I said, I found it and when I started to put a file to it, I could see that it was green underneath. So, and I filed on it, I saw it was green stone. So I wondered if I could make a, a bowl out of it and I did, so that's what, that's what I did. I want to encourage young men and women to follow their dreams and goals, pick up these things and just take it a lot further than we've drawn it. Yana ha yo me yani, yeah, 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 y